Hi guys, just wanted to give you an update on my system. Um, this is very home series specific. Um, home series is a, a home automation system, a, a software program that runs on Windows machines. Um, and this is my system. Basically, I, I've updated my system. I used to have just an old Pentium 4 or a dual core machine with two gig of RAM. I've really upgraded. I've gone towards a, a shuttle PC, um, which is quite a small PC. This is really dedicated to music and home here, and that's it. Um, it has a quad core 3770S processor. Um, it has 16 gig of RAM, and it's just got an OS hard drive. All other storage is stored on the NAS. Um, this is a one point, at the moment it's configured with 1.7 terabytes. Um, of that, a lot of that's redundant space, um, so it actually packs up so that if one disk dies, the others are still available. All right, so back to my automation system. So I have the HomeSeer server, which runs on a UPS, um, and this keeps internet server essential services up. The runtime varies depending on the load. Um, on average, it's about 30 minutes um, that it will keep running for if the power goes off. Um, which is more than enough. Um, if the power's off for much more than that, there's not much that I can do anyway. All right, so from the home automation system, um, I have a current cost um, Envy, which basically just means that it, uh, it reads the power usage of the whole house. So as you can see on this, 712 watts is the current usage. Um, I've got modem and router um, set in bridge mode, so the router handles all the authentication. Um, and then up here I have a, a W800, which is essentially a, um, a radio receiver for motion sensors, much like this X10 motion sensor. So the house knows because of the door and the window sensors and everything else being received by this device and then processed by the automation computer exactly um, what room's got motion, what room doesn't, and so on. So then I also have this RFX COM receiver. This is a similar receiver to the last one, it's just on a different frequency. So this one is responsible for um, ATI remotes. Um, which will shortly be integrated into the TV system and also temperature sensors. Um, so I also have a pager receiver which is connected into this same system so pager messages can be received. And controlling all of, all of the lights and appliances through this system is an X10 system. Um, X10 is a power line communication system um, and near the switchboard I have a serial to Ethernet server which basically lets me connect a, an X10 power line communication device to my network um, and because it's connected to my network I don't have to run really long cables and everything else because I already had a network cable there um, and that lets me turn lights on and off when someone walks by check doors, um, do security, all of that standard stuff. Um, any questions, feel free to ask um, or visit the Homesear forums where I'm sort of active. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.